Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Chemistry and of course today I'm going to round up our study on benzene and we're going to be seeing the uses of what of benzene. Okay, so benzene has a variety of uses but before we continue do not forget that this tutorial is brought to you by the O3 Schools Jam CBT Practice app. If you want to succeed in your jam, it is one app that you need in your closet. Alright, you can look at our testimonies from previous years and see how the app has helped students tremendously to learn and to succeed. Alright, your case will not be different in Jesus name. Please download the application, activate it. It has wonderful features I'll talk about in a moment. But let us see a question from the app. This is a 2008 question. 2008 question number 15. Okay, so this is chemistry. And today we are looking at the uses, uses of benzene. All right, which is the concluding part of our study on benzene. So the question is being displayed on your screen right now. It says, the vulcanizer solution, vulcanizer solution, okay? So it's trying to tell that which of these can what? Can dissolve rubber, all right? That is what the question is telling us, okay? Which of the following can dissolve rubber, all right? So to form a solution. So they say the vulcanizer solution is prepared by dissolving rubber in A, they say ethanol, B, kerosene, C, benzene, D, petrol all right so we're going to come back to this question and many more at the end of the class all right so please make sure you stay to the end of the class download the application the app has all the past questions you need so you don't need to worry about past questions the app also has lecture notes structured according to the jam syllabus so you need to read according to your jam syllabus so it, it has lecture notes so you no need to go and worry about textbook at all then this question search feature you can search a question according to topic and not the question that jam has set under that topic will come out for you to answer then lastly there's a mock challenge utme mock challenge every saturday every saturday so every saturday you prepare with that challenge you get used to jump past questions you get to likely exam questions you see your score release every saturday so you're able to track your progress all right so please it is that app you need activation fee is just a little token make sure you pay and activate your application so let us continue uses of benzene so one of the foremost important uses of benzene is that benzene is very useful as what as a solvent okay it is useful as a solvent okay it is used as a solvent. This is oh, this is solvent in many industrial, commercial, and research projects. Okay, it is useful as a solvent in many commercial, what industrial and research, what and research was projects. So please, benzene is a very very popular solvent. It's a very popular solvent. It's even used in the manufacturing of chemical and plastic products. Okay, this is in the manufacture of chemical and plastic products. Okay, examples uh, is what are what are resins, e.g., resins. Okay, they use the manufacture of what of resins. Okay, they also use the manufacture of synthetic products. They are also used in the manufacture of synthetic products. Synthetic, synthetic products, such as nylon. Okay, so that's styrofoam. Okay, so and the likes. All right, so they're also useful in what in manufacture of what of plastic products like resins, synthetic products like nylon and styrofoam, and the rest. It's also very useful in the manufacture of asphalt, asphalt, which is what used in uh, used by what by paving and roofing companies. As used by what by paving and roofing companies. Okay, so please, you must take note of all of all these uses. So benzene is a very, very important solvent, okay? All right, that is used industrially, that is commercially, even for research, it is used, all right? You say, of, of course, that uh, is for producing what synthetic, uh, both plastic products and synthetic products as these examples that we have shown. So please, you must take note of all of these uses. Also, uh, Benzene also is used in what in producing what other what other solvents. It's, it's even used in manufacture of what of other what materials. All right. So let us see examples. It is used in manufacturing of what of other compounds. Number two. It is sorry. It is used in the manufacturing of compounds. Such as, such as um, as styrene, 
All right, styrene, you know what styrene is, right? So this is your benzene. If you did not join us when we are doing benzene derivatives, that one is your problem. All right, so go back and watch benzene derivative. So benzene derivative, uh, styrene is a what? It's a benzene ring with what? With a double bond. Okay, this is called styrene. This is called what? Styrene. All right, so it's used in what? In the manufacture of what? Of other compounds such as what? Styrene. All right, styrene is used in the production of nylon. It's used in the production of what of lino. You must take note of that. It is also used in the what in the manufacture of what of toluene. All right, toluene also. Okay, we know what toluene is. Toluene is a benzene ring, a benzene ring that has what a methyl group attached. Okay, this is toluene. Okay, this toluene is used in the manufacture of an explosive called TNT. You may see it in your past question. Okay, called what TNT. This is called trinitrotoluene. Okay, it is an explosive on a bomb. We want to bomb. Okay, you are gonna have that. <laughs> please don't bomb anybody. All right, so please, uh, it's used in the manufacture of what? Or trinitrotoluene, which is what? TNT. All right, also, it also has other what? Uh, uh, compounds that what it produces. We also have trichlorophenol. Trichlorophenol. Uh, tri trichlorophenol. All right, you know what phenol is, right? A benzene ring with what? With an OH group is a phenol. Okay, so they talk about trichlorophenol. That means we have what? Chlorine in like what? In like, let's say, three what parts. Okay, in what? Like what? Three, three different chlorine groups attaching itself to a benzene ring and what? And the OH group, trichlorophenol. All right, so it's also used what? In the manufacture of what? Of trichloro what? Phenol, which is used as a disinfectant. This trichlorophenol is used as a disinfectant. All right. Also, do you know it's also used in the manufacture of aniline? Aniline is a benzene ring, benzene ring with what? An NH2 group attached. You call it aniline. All right. This aniline is used as a dye, as a dye, it's used as a dye, D I E. And it's also used. In in uh, in drug manufacture, also in drug manufacture. All right, so please take note of what of all this what uses. So that is what benzene. Benzene is used in what manufacturing of what of other compounds. Okay, all right, such as styrene, like I said, such as what toluene, such as what aniline, such as trichlorophenol. All right, and so on and so forth. Do you know that benzene is also useful in manufacture of tires? Okay, even your tires, okay, your car tires, benzene is useful in the manufacture of what of tires. All right, let us see that. Okay, let us see that it is also useful. Number three, it is used in the manufacture of car tires. All right, even the even the sole of your shoe, okay, that sole, okay, benzene is also what an important what. Uh, it's also important when we manufacture of what of all those what your your shoe soles, your shoe soles. It's also useful in the printing industry. It is useful in the printing industry. Okay, it's also very useful in the what in the printing what industry, all right? Because in the printing industry, uh, we need we, we need ink, Abby. We need ink, and ink is not usually what solid, usually what liquid, all right? Even your painting, if you want to paint your house, all those paints that you buy, okay, most of them before you're able to what to paint them, you have to what put them what in liquid form, all right? So it's benzene that is what to keep them what in that what in that liquid form, all right? So benzene is very very useful. It's very useful also in what in the printing industry. Also, it's used as fuels. It is used as fuels. Okay, it is used as fuels. All right, because benzene also has a very high octane number. That's a high octane number rating, and so it is used as well as, as it's used as fuels by several manufacturers. All right, sometimes it is used an, as an addict as an additive to make fuel burn more to make uh, fuel burn more efficiently. It is used as an additive to make fuel burn more efficiently. So these are so many different uses of what of benzene. But let us quickly go to the app and answer the question, and then we are done with this class. The next task by entering Arcanos. All right, so let us see. 2008, number 15, it says, the vulcanizer solution is prepared by dissolving rubber in, the vulcanizer solution is prepared by dissolving rubber in, that's why I say this question is also telling you that, okay, which of the following can dissolve rubber? All right, A, ethanol, ethanol cannot dissolve rubber, all right? B, kerosene, kerosene cannot dissolve rubber. C, benzene 
benzene can dissolve water rubber. It can dissolve rubber. Okay, it's a solvent that can dissolve water rubber to form a solution. Then D, petrol. Petrol also cannot do that. So, please, that is what the correct answer there is what will be, will be benzene. It's an important use, all right? So, just search for use of benzene. You'll see what many other questions from this using the question side feature on the O3 School Jam CBT app. My name is Master T, the commander of this great army, all right? As a soldier, you have to work, keep grinding. You have to work, keep studying. You have to work, keep your steeds. Maintain it, all right? And have a very, very good and successful score, all right? So, in the next class, we'll see Akanos. Love to see you there. Thank you for watching.